thank you very much vijay now uh, before uh, commencing the session i would like to share some of the views uh, i uh, remember that when commodity exchanges started functioning in the year 2003 2004 agri watch functions on pulses also started at the same time uh, as i remember and I, i i also remember that in 2004 for the first time in our country a uh, futures trading in pulses started uh, that was with chana urad tuar so many commodities uh, which was first of its kind in the entire world because uh pulses futures contracts were not available on any of the international exchanges like comex or topcom or any other exchange the reason being that uh, pulses is an important crop in india uh, in terms of consumption as well as production but which is not so in case of in respect of other countries so uh, the trade welcomed it very well uh, the entire country started participating in pulses futures trading and the uh, result or the one of the um, instances to prove that was the first function of agri watch where i i know for sure that agri watch uh, arranged it in uh, delhi only uh, initially they thought about a total uh, uh, registration of around 300 400 people and they booked a hall uh, uh, for that capacity but because of huge uh, response from so many people con uh, concerned with pulses trade in fact they had to change the venue and they had to go for a place which, which can accommodate around 700 people so that was the resp response from pulse trade and pulse industry now today compared to that the response is low the reason is it can be attributed uh, if we believe in statistics and direct correlation whatever that a ban of urad and tuar is one of the reason why we have uh, less number of people assembled here so we have only one chana <laughs> so only chana has brought uh, some people to uh, uh, listen to this thing but at the same time what i believe that uh, over a period of uh, last 4 5 years uh, the government has also started realizing that futures trading is not responsible for price inflation in any case it has been proved by rbi mm, it was not conclusively proved by abhijit sen committee but the recent report published by rbi clearly establishes that futures trading is actually not responsible for price inflation so we believe in future the government is also going to uh, take certain steps for revival of futures trading in all those commodities which were banned in past sugar is one of them uh, maybe uh, sugar uh, futures will uh, start very soon and similarly uh, we believe urad and tuar can also start in near future now uh, with this i would like to uh, firstly invite uh, ms rupa mehta uh, she is commodity analyst will india group to give a presentation before you on broker's perspective in spot market <laughs> 